Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez stirred up a controversy this morning when she said this about the treatment of migrants on the southern border with Mexico. The United States is running concentration camps on our southern border, and that is exactly what they are. They are concentration camps. And um, if that doesn't bother you, I don't, I got, I like, we can have, okay, whatever. I wanna talk to the people that are concerned enough with humanity to say that we should not, that never again means something. The comments have triggered a backlash, and Ocasio-Cortez tweeted out her response to the criticism, saying that, quote, shrieking Republicans should know the difference between death camps and concentration camps, and this is about mass detention. Now, her comments come as President Trump tweeted out that ICE, Immigration and Customs Enforcement, Custom Enforcement, would begin removing the millions of undocumented immigrants from the U.S. starting as soon as next week. A senior immigration official telling CNN, though, there is no operation next week to pick up millions, and they have no clue where the president got that impression. The senior official also said that there are tentative plans for an operation in July in 10 cities to pick up families who did not show up to their immigration hearings and have removal orders. A target list is not final, but it is not millions, that official said. And Jim Acosta is here with us, our chief White House correspondent. So um, I wonder, when you're looking at Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, she's trying now to make this distinction between, you know, she wasn't saying death camps, but she, she brought up never again. It seemed actually yeah. that she sort of, it seemed like she was trying to make a connection. What did you make of what she was saying? Well, I think what she was trying to say, and I, I'm not going to explain away what she had to say, but uh, you know, this is this is a real sticking point in the Democratic Party, and I think for a lot of Americans, in terms of what's been going on down at the border, this family separation policy that went on for several months, it resulted in the separation of children from their mothers, and some of those kids went into jail or cage. Uh, like settings, and you know that has certainly uh, unnerved a lot of people in the Latino community. And, and going back to what the president tweeted last night, it sounded as if he was talking about this deportation force that he uh, talked about during the uh, 2016 presidential campaign. I talked to a senior administration official this morning who said over at the Department of Homeland Security, there are not a lot of happy faces over there because they believe that the president essentially let the cat out of the bag that this operation was coming. This official said the operation is not imminent, as you were just saying. A few moments ago, maybe not next week, but they are talking about an operation to sweep up undocumented immigrants, and that includes families. And this is going to concern a lot of people in the Latino community because, you, as you know, Brianna, a lot of these families are mixed status families. And so if you go in and try to sweep up families looking for undocumented immigrants, you may actually, in fact, sweep up people who are documented or even U.S. citizens. So there's a lot of concern out there. And splitting up adults from children, again, which right. has been a political issue for the administration.